Montana. Big sky country. The treasure state. People got a lot of names for it. I just call it home. Lived here my whole life. Still amazed at how beautiful it is. Maybe that's what blinded us to how ugly the people were getting. Good day to you, brother. You don't understand. No one took these groups seriously. They were different. Religious. Militant. I mean, it was a goddamn cult. The collapse is upon us, my children. They started buying up every farm for miles. Then the radio station. Not long after that, they even had the fucking cops. Their own sovereign religious state built right here, under our noses. Ain't no one coming to help us. The government can't do shit. We're on our own. Friends, we save those lost souls, whether they want to be saved or not. People don't want to believe groups like this exist. People are scared, man. Some will wish to harm us. Some will wish to destroy all that we have built here together. Some will betray us. We don't know what he's capable of. How? Who? Their leader. Joseph Seed. They call him the Father. And those in the outside world are blind. They do not believe. They have no faith. But I will make them see. <laughs>
They'll be in the church. Stick close. Eyes open. These folks can spook easily. Rook, pardon me. Stay loose, huh? What are they doing here? Be calm. Stay calm, everyone. Just go about your business. This doesn't concern it. Sheriff, I don't like this. Everything's fine, Nancy. Everything's just fine. Jesus Christ, you're wearing badges, aren't you? Yeah, but they don't respect badges much out here. They'll respect a 9mm. Not every problem can be solved with a bullet portion. Because we know what happens next. They will come. They will try to take from us, take our guns, take our freedom, take our faith. But we will not let them. Sheriff, sure, come on. Hold on we will not let their greed or their immorality or their depravity hurt us anymore. Sheriff, sure, there will be no more thing. suffering. Oh, fuck it. Joseph C. I have a warrant issued for your arrest on the suspicion of kidnapping with the intent to harm. Now, I want you to step forward and keep your hands where I can see them. There they are, the locusts in our garden. See, they've come for me. They've come to take me away from you. They've come to destroy all that we've built. This moment would come. We've prepared for it. Go. Go. God will not let them take me. I saw when the Lamb opened the first seal, and I heard, as it were, the noise of thunder, one of the four beasts say, Come and see. Step forward. And I saw. And behold, it was a white horse. And the hell followed with him. Rookie, cuff this son of a bitch. God will not let you take me. on him. Sometimes the best thing to do is to walk away. Let's go. Back up! Back up. 
Fine here. Unfolding according to God's plan. I'm still here with you. The first seal has been broken. The collapse has begun. And we will take what we need. We will preserve what we have. And we will kill all those who stand in our way. And these, the harbingers of doom, will see the truth. Let the bird, God's will, this is the punishment. 
Isabel Matthews. It's bad. They ambushed him. He's dead. We need to find those sinners. Head for the lumber mill. I'll be waiting. I need some help up here. The sinners could be anywhere. Do you hear me? We got a problem. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Rook, I'm sorry. I thought they got you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Check the room, Rook. Oh, Jesus. I had no idea. Fuck. We're putting his whole family away. All of them. Fucking lunatics. We're gonna get out of this, rookie. First things first, gotta arm ourselves. Here. All right, here's what we're gonna do. There's a road out there. We're gonna take it, we're gonna head northeast. It's probably only a few hours back to Missoula, and then, we're gonna come back here with a goddamn National Guard, and we're gonna take out the rest of these... Okay, shh.
plane? Don't you tell me they are fucking air You know what that shit means? It means the roads have all been closed. It means the phone lines have been cut. It means there's no signals getting in and out of this valley. But mostly it means we're all fucked. Goddamn collapse. They all think the world's coming to an end now. They've been waiting for it, for years. Waiting for somebody to, to come along and fulfill their prophecy and kick off their goddamn holy war. Well, you sure as shit kicked. <sighs> Smartest thing for me to do would just be to hand you over. <sighs> Get out of that uniform. We need to burn it. There's some fresh clothes there. When you get changed, you come and see me. We'll see if we can unfuck this situation.
I didn't properly introduce myself back there. Most folks call me Dutch. I've been trying to piece together what's happening up top. It ain't good. Little I can gather is that your partners are alive for now. Seems they've been split up, each one handed off to a different member of Joseph's family. You want them back, I get it, I get it. I got friends that have been taken too. Problem is, there ain't no help coming. Nobody knows what's going on here, and they won't know until it's too late. There's got to be people out there willing to fight back against this cult. We just, we need to show them how. We need to build us a resistance. So the first thing we're going to do is get control of this island. Once we got some breathing room, we can figure out what's coming next. There's a gun and a map in the safe over there. Take them. I'll give you a call on your radio once you get your bearings. Looney fanatics are out of control. If you want to protect yourself, I think there's a prepper stash near the boathouse. Should have some good gear squirreled away.
impression you may want to build some dynamite. Luckily, folks around here have been stockpiling all the materials you might need. So just grab them up and get crafting. down by the docks. You help him out, and maybe he'd be willing to pick up a gun and return the favor. Seriously, thank you. Open hand. Send a message. 
Smart thinking. Take what the dead don't need. my back.
Copy. thinking and no. I ain't gonna have you climbing towers all over the county for me, so don't worry. Also, try not to fall from up there. I'm there. divided into three regions. To the north, you got the Whitetail Mountains. It's run by Jacob Seed, oldest brother of that fucking family. Jacob's the one training the cult, and he's damn good at what he does. Eli and the Whitetail Militia have been trying to hold out, but Jacob's ready to step on their necks. Southeast of there, you got the Henbane River. That's Faith's territory. The little sister. I've heard all sorts of stories about people losing their minds in a place called the Bliss. Now, head west to the Holland Valley. John Seeds just rolled in there and has taken everything in the name of the cult. Food, supplies, and worst of all, people. Now, they're gonna have plenty more calls all over the county. I'll keep you posted on anything that'll be useful. The fog should be clearing soon. Which means we can get you off this island. Sit tight. Shouldn't be much longer. Oh shit. Deputy, I'm picking up something new out of Holland Valley. It's a broadcast from John. You need to see this. We are all sinners. Every one of us. You, me. <laughs> Even the Father knows deeply of sin. It's a poison that clouds our minds. What if I told you you could be free from sin? What if I told you that everything you ever dreamed could come true? What if I told you that everything could be overcome if you embraced an idea? That freedom from sin can come from the power of just one word. Yes, I must be redeemed. If you're watching this, know that you have been selected. You will be cleansed, 
you will confess your sins, and you will be offered atonement. Don't worry. You don't have to do anything. We'll come for you. Welcome to Eden's Gate. Fuck. John Seed's got your partner, Hudson. She's in a world of shit, kid. You gotta get going. into the henbane. Don't trust anything you see. And sure as shit, don't believe a word that Faith says. Also, steer clear of those white flowers. They seem harmless, but they will fuck your shit up. If you don't believe me, just wait until you come across some of those shambling junkies. Cult calls them angels. But they'll tear through you like shit through a goose.
goods, equipment, whatever they want. Even people. John Seed is forcing them out of their homes and making them join the cult. If folks refuse, well, let's just say they ain't treated well. Worst of it seems to be centered around Falls End, so I'd head that way.
He will wipe every tear from their eyes. There will be no more death or mourning or crying or pain. For I know the plans that I have made for you, declared the Lord. Plans to prosper you and not to harm you. Plans to give you hope and a future. <laughs> ah, I don't claim to know God's plans, but I know a good thing when I see it. Getting quite a reputation, deputy. You're the first good thing to happen to this valley in a long time. A little help? Are you trying to break your neck? It just seemed like a good idea at the time. Yeah. Thanks. Shit. It's you. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't realize. All you've done, might as well add Mover to the list, huh? <laughs> I thought that Eden's Gate confiscated all of this. Hell kind of fair grave would I be if I didn't have a hidden stash? <laughs> Learn from the best. <laughs> this town has been through a lot, Deputy. We owe you thanks, but... I know you're looking for your people. But the truth is, you ain't the only one in need of help. The pastor and I can only do so much. If you could see about lending a hand, be sure to return the favor. What do you say? Get you squared away. When you get the chance, come by the church. I'll be there. <laughs>